Hi everybody and welcome in my Advent Challenge 2016. We've just finished the Fires, Glutes and Abs Challenge in the fall. We've just finished 21 days, hopefully you did. If not, just be surprised and be excited about what's to come. We're gonna have 24 days of quick workouts. We're gonna try to squeeze in our hassle, our holiday hassle, squeeze in small workouts because we tend to neglect our form and our fitness while we are rushing to get to get the house decorated, to get baked cookies and buy presents and get everything ready and beautiful for Christmas. Don't forget about yourself. Make sure that you stay fit in this season, in this pre-Christmas season, and I will try to guide you through this challenge here with quick workouts every day and new quick workouts. We want to start today with a step quick cardio workout, so we need a step, but you can also go and use just the floor and without stepping up. We will, might want to need a mat and we also need a pair of heavier or medium weight dumbbells depending on your fitness level. You can also do modifications. I will show you as we proceed through this workout. You can use your body weight only if you're having troubles with your joints or lifting or whatever, but try to stay with me with this minutes here and let's do the best that you can. So let's start here today already day one in our Advent Challenge 2016. So start with me here in a step tap. Already start using and engaging your thighs and glutes by stepping wide and stepping low. When you come center, both feet on the floor and you come at your baby squat. Now I want you to twist, twist your body, your torso. To the side. Start engaging your abs and your obliques. Get your chest open up. Keep it open and proud. Get low. Twist, pivot that hip into the turn of your torso. Are you feeling this? Great. Let's get the blood pumping, blood flowing, and the heart pumping. Let's get warmed up. Now I want you to add a reach. Opposite side, but keep tapping in and turn. Turn, and just lift the diagonal. Right in front of you, a little forward, a little up. Tap your toes strong, squeeze your glutes. Your abs are tight. Tuck your navel in. Now, reach up to the diagonal of the seat. Stretch. Lengthen your shoulders, your back. Twist, pivot, tap. Squeeze your bum. Beautiful. You reach and lengthen. Feel the stretch over your posture muscles. Beautiful. Last one. Come here with your feet close together. Tap out to the side. Just give me tap out here, right and left. Come down, sink into your knees, push your hips back so that you're in a baby narrow squat when you're having both feet on the floor. All right. Come on, squeeze your bum. Great. Come on, smile. This is going to be fun, quick and sweet. I promise. So now take your arms with this move. Come on, up. Big arms, strong arms. Up, down, up, down. Tap out, strong to the side, squeeze your glutes. Squeeze that butt. Exhale. And lift those arms overhead. Feel your heart rate up. Come on. We're getting there. Come back into a step tap. Now, pivot. 
and turn your torso right into this. Strong abs. Now reach. Exhale. Beautiful. Reach up. Straight up. Lengthen. Still pivot that hip. Tap that toe. Squeeze your butt. Abs are tight. Last one. Narrow feet. Tap up. Sink low. Into your knees and back. Push back your hips. Take your arms, come on, up, down, up, down. All right. Quick warm up here. Last one, and then last one to the left. Now, give me lunges, front lunges, like this. Sink down. Make sure your knee is tracking over your ankle. So step wide. What I want you to do now, I want you to chop. If you want, circle your arms in front and then chop. It's just a soft chop, okay? Chop, chop, and circle to come the other side. Come on, use your glutes. Get your quads warmed up. Couple more. Last one. Beautiful. What we want to do now, come here with your feet wide. I want you to come into a knee repeater. Two, three, four. Now. Turn your heel out, and now, other side, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, and heel, come on, other side, get right into it. Other side. And give me a heel. Other side. Heel. Last one here. How was that? Woohoo! Hamstrings. Curls. Come on. We curl that heel into the butt. If you want, add a hop. Pull those arms down strong. A couple more. Two, one. How are you feeling? Woo! Come on, dig your heel. Catch your breath. And grab your step. If you don't use this, if you're not going to use a step, I'm going to show you the modifications. Okay. So let's see, how are we gonna do this? We wanna work in intervals, okay? 40 seconds of exercise, 15 seconds of rest. Then we're going for the second round. And then we're going for the next exercise. So let me start here to give you an exhibition of the first two exercises, okay? So we're combining here cardio, one exercise of cardio, one exercise of strength. So the first 
move that we're gonna do is we here. Okay, so we're going fast like this, low impact. You keep on just tapping up without bouncing. Okay, just take out the skip and the hop. If you don't, if you're not using a step, make it a knee reach. Okay, just lift your knee up to your chest and try to make it as big of a big range of motion as you can. And I want you to crunch your knee, your elbow into your knee so that you're using more muscle than you just would with a knee lift, okay? The next exercise I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna grab my dumbbells, is a step up, all right? You're stepping up with one foot, your foot is completely on the floor, on the step. Now you're coming up, pressing up. Step down and do it again. Shoulder press. When you press yourself up through your heels, squeeze your glutes and your, your butt, okay? We're going for 40 seconds on the one side, on the right side, and 40 seconds on the left side. Okay. I'm gonna set the timer and we want to start. Whew. I'm already sweating. Come on, let's do this. Toe taps, 40 seconds. Give me your best. Arms are strong, your abs are tight. You light on your feet. You're just tapping your toes on the step. You're not stepping up. 15 more seconds to go. All right, come on, five more. And relax, grab your dumbbells. Like I said, you can also use your body weight only. And if you're doing this without a step, you're just going like this. You're lifting up, okay, so. Tap and press up, tap. You're feeling this very soon. Woo. Press up so that you can see your dumbbells. Press up through the heel. Two more seconds, last one, rest, and we're going to start with toe taps again, and now we're going for one step press up with shoulder presses, all right, are you ready, come on, strong arms, your navel is tucked in, Okay, 20 more to go, half time. If you want to change into low impact, go ahead. Stay with me. Woo! Last one. Beautiful, grab your dumbbells. We're going to the other side. Catch your breath. All right, let's go. Tap down. Your body weight is on your other leg and not on the stepping leg. Exhale. Half time. Five more seconds. Give me one more. 
Woo! Beautiful. Drop your dumbbells. I'm going to show you the next set of exercises. Catch your breath. Just step side, step side to side here. Step touch. Keep on moving. Don't stand still. We want to keep the heart rate up. What we want to do is we want to jump over. So I need to adjust my equipment here. We want to come here and step, touch our palms on the step, all right? So you're here. And now I want you just to jump over. You can skip. You can give an Indian. Sorry. You can do an intermediate skip of the toes. It's like this. Otherwise, just go here and go quick. Lift your feet up. Squeeze your booty. All right, that's the first cardio exercise of the second segment. What we want to do now, whoo, we want to come into a plank position. The next exercise is a plank. So you're here, yeah, right? Your toes are strong on the bench. Now once you walk in, hips up, walk down. Pike your hips up. When you're stepping or you're walking, your hands in. And you walk back down or you come into a flat plank. That's our strength exercise. Exercise. Fellow. <laughs> My, my sweat is already pouring down. So are you ready to do this to start? I'm gonna set the timer. Get yourself done. You can do this, of course, on the floor. 40 seconds. Lift your feet high. Squeeze your booty. Core is tight. I want you to really have your core, your navel tucked in. <sighs> These are tough. Catch your breath. Let's come down to plank. Toes are strong. Step in, walk in. And hold. Alternating hands. Oh yes. Oh my gosh. Like I said, short and sweet. Catch your butt. Now I'm going to show you with the next round, the low impact version. Okay? Here, just twist and circle your legs around and step up back. And twist. Go as quick as you can for your own pace. Go quicker. Whew, I need to wipe off my sweat. Beautiful. Let's come to the floor. 
plank toes on the bench come up hold walk in with the other hand first core 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 your navel is tucked into your spine okay Oh yes. Whew. 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 Calm down. Catch your breath. Okay. That was interval number two. I want you to catch your breath. Step touch with me. And circle your arms in front of your chest. Stretch. Beautiful. Whew. Now I want to show you the next two exercises and it's the last two. Like I said, short and sweet, but we're really going to kick it. The next move is very simple. We just, we're here, okay? And then we're just hopping over with strong arms, piking our elbows back, giving ourselves power, range of motion, explosive move when we jump up when we're in the center. That's the first cardio move. The next move is another plank exercise. We're gonna come back to the into that plank exercise. The toes are on the bench, step whatever you're using. Now, I just want you to tap in. Tap on the floor, alternating sides. 40 seconds. Are you ready to do this? I've been sweating myself already. Let's try this. Come on. I got strong. Press up through your heel. Your core is tight, your navel is tucked to your spot. Come on, pike your elbows back. Feel your booty. Land light. Woo! Five more seconds. Woo! We're working it. Catch your breath. Come down to the floor. Plank. Tap. Oh my gosh. Whew. Breathe. Catch your breath. Are you ready to go again? Come on, let's start from the other side. Low impact, you're just here. Take out the hop, okay? But go quick. Change feet, stay low. Use your arms. Go quicker, as quick as you can. Tuck your elbows back and up. Quads. Come back down to plank. Last one here. Core is really tight. Stay strong. 
Tap your toe in and on the floor. Breathe. Your wrists are right underneath your shoulders. Oh my gosh. Come up. How are you doing? I'm gonna stop the timer. Come step on your on your step and give me a side lunge. Stretch you in the flat. Let's do that on the other side. Step up into a front lunge and drop your back knee as low as you can. Come on, raise your arms up. Stretch your hip flexor in your quad of your back leg. Woo! Beautiful. Open your knee of the front leg a little bit. Intensify that hip flexor stretch. Oh my gosh. Feels so good. Let's do this on the other side. I don't know about you, but I am a sweaty mess. That was a quick, dirty, and very effective workout. Come on, open that knee to the side. Drop your knee as low as you can. Arms up, chest is open. Come on. I want you to come into a wide stance. You're here. Now grab your foot on that side. Grab around that, wrap around that leg a little bit. Twist, turn into this. Do this on the other side, come on. Breathe. Beautiful, now come to the center, drop your palms to the floor and pulse. Turn your toes out to the side here and I want you to sink or push your hips down. Come on, your palms are on the floor and drop your hips down and up. Down and up, down. We're stretching, but we're still working it. Last one. Now, I want you to roll up one vertebrae at a time, shoulders last. And relax. That was day one, December 1st, 2016, in our Advent Challenge 2016. I hope you had fun and I hope you're sweating just as I am. And I hope to see you tomorrow for day two, December 2nd. Take care and have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye. Oh, you're spinster.